back at it again with another video out here camping with some some buddies out here in the mountains at this uh beautiful small river should be a good place to try and catch maybe some trout rainbow trout or brown trout really like to catch a brown trout today that'd be a new species for me so that's kind of the goal today but there's also other species we could run into and you know we fished a little bit in the evening and i caught a couple of little red breasts out of this little spot so they weren't very big but it was something might have some other friends uh join me later on i'm going to just start wading upstream there's also some fall fish in here big fall fish so I don't really have much else to say. It should be an interesting day out here. A little different environment than uh, where I usually fish, but it's pretty early in the morning. You know, without uh, further ado, you never know until you throw. So, let's go. So I'm in the water here. Got this little Rapala original floating minnow here kind of a crankbait jerk jerk bait type of lure here this is what i caught the red breasts on uh they were hitting it near the surface so i figured i'd try this for a little while I might downsize to some other crankbaits or um maybe some soft plastics or a spinner i think this little could all work today you know we've got kind of pretty cloudy conditions it's supposed to actually rain uh throughout the day so if it does start to kind of storm or something then that might curtail the fishing but for now we're just gonna start casting hopefully we'll beat the rain maybe catch a few catch a few trout out here or who knows I really will take any species today but that would be ideal because I really don't have many opportunities to fish for trout. I mean, there's some that they stock in the city, but I feel like fishing for stock fish just isn't that exciting to me. Especially trout, like you can just catch them on little, you know, power bait and stuff like that. It's just not very exciting, but it's good if you uh, want something to eat. My friend Soren out here using one of my other setups for a little while. Oh, had a hit. Yeah, I think it was small, but something tried to get it. Something bumped our little, our pala here. People. They're not quite committing. Maybe we need something smaller or... More slower. Got one. Good one. Oh, yeah. It was right in that tiny little calm spot. We should stay hooked. I'm gonna try that again. That looked like similar to the one yesterday. I snagged a trout yesterday, people, on this lure. But if you snag it, I don't, I don't count it, you know, it went. All right, people, this is kind of a calm spot, but I'm still seeing some fish kind of cruising around, some little smallmouth, mostly. So I'm gonna go ahead and make a few casts in here. See if we can I mean usually the fish in the, these areas are not going to be the most active, but so 
So I'm gonna cast around. That's some overhanging brush over here. Soren said he caught a little sunfish and has been seeing some good trout. Further up here, there's a nice looking spot. Got a hit? Oh, I think that's a rock bass. Yeah, it looks like it. Nice, dude. Well, I can, uh, yeah, try to get over there and. That's a chubby little rock bass there. It's a pretty little fish. Yeah, it is. All right. Cool. Yeah, I think I, I had a, I've seen some smallmouth, like not big, but, yeah. and I had one little one strike the lure and get off. Yeah, I think there's a decent size smallmouth. I feel like around this bend up here, that little hole over there, and then this one right here, where the water is rushing through there, I feel like that's going to be Yeah, that little next to the current there. Yeah. Yeah, that could be a juicy spot. Like I said, that big old boy, you know, strilling from over here, he came for it and he turned around. Yeah, I'm going to... I mean, this little area right here looks... Pretty juicy too. Oh, <laughs> tiny fish, baby rock bass. <laughs> oh, I saw him come out for that. That was funny. You're a hungry guy, aren't you? Had a hit? Like. Alright guys, baby rock bass. It's like four inches. Hungry guy. I mean it's just the rock bass hole right here. Yep. Like another bass. another rock bass. They're going to town over there, huh? Yeah. It's a decent one. There you go. Pretty yeah. Man, Connor's got some work to do now. Yeah. <laughs> Nothing that impressive yet. But... Oh, had a little bump. I think I might change lures soon. 
All right, people, so we got some bites on that Impala, but I have a trouble with the hookups, and I feel like we're, you know, we're missing some fish throwing that, so switch to this brass spinner. This is one that I made. Got kind of that um, turtleback Oklahoma blade with sort of a hammered pattern. It's cloudy out here, so I went with the gold or the brass. We'll see if it pays off. Oh, dude, stay hooked, please, dude. Oh my gosh. <laughs> First, cast. First freaking, or that was like a second cast. Oh my gosh, he's strong. It's a trout. Please don't get unhooked. <sighs> Whoa, dude. Who's the big boy? Golly, and strong. Here's a keeper. Dude. If you can tire out dude that was crazy right there oh you okay i think gold gold blades might be the way to go i have a i have some more gold spinners cloudy day usually gold is better oh my gosh it's still fighting Got to be easy with them on this little rod, though. Come on, dude. You can break the rod. Well, they can break the line. It's only a four-pound line, so. Beautiful fish. Wow. Let's go. Dude. Beautiful trout. Really All right, people, look at this. Look at this trout. It's a beautiful rainbow just came up and smoked this brass spinner it's one of my hand-built spinners and he just nailed it in that current slow retrieve letting it kind of get deep and he just came up out of nowhere and nailed it so like i said we're going to try to keep some of these fish uh man beautiful trout I haven't caught a trout in a long time I can get a picture of them and put them in my bag and yeah i'll get i'll give you a, uh, another lure too I think the gold might be the might be the key. Yeah. All right, guys, check out this trout. Beautiful rainbow trout. Probably 15 inches, maybe 16. Nice fish. Yeah, it's a nice trout, dude. <laughs> yeah, let me get you a lure. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I can. You can see the rainbow you just caught. 14 inches. At least, at least 14 inches. It's in his bag. We're gonna be eating tonight. Oh, I've got some up here. What? Let's buy a couple of tenor asses up here. Oh yeah. We caught a bunch of rock bass too. I've caught like five rock bass. Look out. Yeah, they, the trout seem to like the a gold blade. It yeah. seems like. Oh, that's what I got on. That's good. Yeah. There's a fish. There's a fish. Another trout. Not as big as the other one. Or what is that? I think it's a trout. <sighs> yeah, not quite as big, but decent fish. Good enough to keep. All right, another trout, people. Another rainbow trout. Good fight. He was sitting behind that little rock and I felt him bump it a couple times and it was game over after that. He choked the spinner too. Good thing we're keeping him because I don't think he would have survived. Yeah, he, he inhaled it. Inhaled the spinner. I wouldn't mind catching a decent sized smallmouth. What's that? So I wouldn't mind catching a decent sized smallmouth. Yeah, I mean, that's Oh, 
Oh. oh <laughs> rock bird. bass. A little rock bass, yeah. Pretty. That was pretty close to us. <laughs> Just came up from the bottom and was like, I'm, e I'm eating that. I said, I'm eating that. That's a pretty little rock bass there. Look at that rock bass, people. That's a pretty one. Get a picture of them and send them, send them back. There we go. Thank you, Mr. Rock Bass. Appreciate you. Got a little tangle. Uh, ooh, what was that, Connor? Got a fish? Nice fall fish, looks like. Let me see your tangle. No, I got it. It came out on its own. Okay. I have a better angle. It's a good mix of species out here. All right, good fall fish. Yeah, that's a nice fish to catch right there. Sometimes yeah. a forward momentum. Yeah, that was a nice fish. Thank you. I wouldn't mind catching one like that. How do I feel? <laughs> feel left out. I did yesterday. James caught three fish in the fucking <laughs> pasture runoff. Really? When? Yesterday, when we like right in front of where we were camping, he just oh. got in and just caught it. Well, I still don't, I still don't count the trout. I don't well, count. Well, you already caught two trout today. So. Yeah, I made up for it. I want to catch a trout, dude. This is not the spot for it, though. Yeah, I need to find some more current if you want to find trout. I wouldn't mind a big old fall fish or a small mouth, though. Yeah, I would like to catch a big fall fish. this fucking three weight it feels brutal. yeah feels nice yeah. looks like it is something small maybe yeah, yeah. Rock bass, I think. it's doing a lot of darting yeah, rock bass. small mouth oh is it chubby small it? chubby small mouth yeah, small mouth. <laughs> small mouth i'll take it Oh my god, dude, he has a crawdad in his mouth. <laughs> That's why he's so chubby. <laughs> yeah, dude, he's got a whole fucking crawdad in there. <laughs> Look at that, James. Greedy. Greedy fish. Holy crap, there's a, there's a big pincher sticking out of yeah, his dude. throat. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, buddy. Oh well. my gosh, you're hungry, aren't you? <laughs> Greedy. Greedy fish. Here's a fish. Ooh, I think it's a fall fish. Decent, yeah. Oh no, it's a bass. Oh, it's a big rock bass. Ooh. Ooh, that's a pretty damn big rock bass. That's probably the biggest one I've ever caught. Nice. Wow, that's a fat one. Ooh, yeah, that's a beauty. Nice. Gorgeous fish, yeah. Love the red eyes. Yeah. Awesome markings. It's like a seven, seven or eight inches probably. Pretty fish. Look at that. Awesome markings. Get a picture of this one for sure. Gorgeous. All right. Thank you, rock bass. That was a. That's a beautiful fish right there. Awesome. Good mix of species in here. For sure. Did you catch a fish? Little rainbow. Nice. Uh, Where did you get him? Right there. Oh, Hell yeah, dude. I thought I saw your rod and it looked like you had been using it still. That's nice cute. fish, dude. Yeah, it's like a 13, 14. Yeah. 
Sweet. He fought like hell. I wasn't gonna keep him, but he uh, pulled him out of here. I he was hooked too bad. Yeah. The well, the second one I got it, it was Mike, just like in his gills. Have you made breakfast yet? No. We might do the trout for breakfast. It's not a bad idea. Right? Yeah. I mean, it's not raining.